foreign direct investments have been one of the most important drivers of economic growth for the past decades in Romania. In an uncertain, competitive global environment, where strategies, behaviors and policies are reconsidered, Romania will have to pay more attention to its FDI attractiveness to obtain sustainable economic recovery and transformation in the post-pandemic world. How do we seize opportunity in times of uncertainty? In 2020, Romania suffered a 27% decrease in FDI projects and was ranked 18th among European countries in terms of FDI attracted. Nevertheless, plans of new expansion show an impressive level of increased attractiveness. 66% of respondents planning new investments in 2021 compared to only 27% in 2020. 2021 investment plans have not been as impacted by the pandemic compared to 2020 levels. 41% of respondents believe Romania's attractiveness will improve in the next three years. Although there is optimism regarding investment intentions, there are still areas that require improvement. Current investment plans are driven by supply chain, logistics and manufacturing for the second year in a row, demonstrating Romania's increased attractiveness in these areas and its potential to become a regional supply hub. The digital economy is regarded as the top sector which will drive Romania's growth in the coming years, a trend present across Europe, highlighted by the pandemic and supported locally by the talent pool and infrastructure resources. When considering Romania as a future destination for FDI, investors take into consideration COVID-19 crisis mitigation and the level of technology adoption, among others. In order to increase the attractiveness and position of our country amongst the top FDI destinations, UI has come up with a set of recommendations based on opinions of top-level investors from 20 countries. 1. Prioritizing digital transformation. 2. Supporting small and medium-sized enterprises while focusing on stimulus and attractive fiscal policies. 3 developing the logistics and manufacturing sector and investing in reliable infrastructure. 4. A higher focus on sustainability and environmental policies. 5. Supporting human capital and skills development.